Okay. So the arena's there. Right over there. I should uh, repair our stuff. We need to sell our things as well. Just repair it all first. So it's all in good condition to sell. Let's have a look at our armor and armor skill and stuff. 98. Athletics is 73. So yeah, we're, we're doing decent. We're doing not that bad. This is the arena, I think. That's the Arboretum. So that, it's obviously the next one. Okay. Yeah, but this is not the end of the LP, guys. I'm sorry. Um, I didn't want to end it, you know, like, on the main quest. Like, the main quest would have just been a poor way to end it, in my opinion. Um, I, I'd, I wanted to end it in another way. Um, by Azura, by Azura, you know, I wanted by to... Well, this LP will end when I... I'm not going to deny it. This LP will end when I finish... Um, when I finish the Umbacano quest line. Because that's the um, the Umbacano quest line I've wanted to do. And I've been doing it since the start of the LP. So if I... End, and it was like the first thing I start, I did, I think. You know, the Umbacano quest line. So I think it'll be good to end on it. You know, so we start on it, so we'll Stop end on it. Already. Well, well, if it isn't Dragonheart. Hello. How's our new grand champion, huh? Grand champion. <laughs> you ready to make me some money? <laughs> Champion of Cyrodiil. Uh, mm. Yeah, I'm a champion of Cyrodiil, aren't I now? As well as the champ grand champion of the arena. <laughs> yes. So yeah, I'm ready for a match. Looks like you've reached your peak. Tell you what, from here on in, you can fight one, two, or three Minotaur Lords. So what's it going to be? Uh, go for the three. You've got it. I'll have the three Minotaur Lords brought out to the arena. Now get up there and give the people what they paid for. Okay. Uh, so yeah, I'm starting to go into planning mode for my Skyrim LP. Um, this, I want to finish this LP soon, especially. Um, now, I don't expect it will go on that long, so don't worry about if you're thinking it's going to be forever. I mean, I'm not doing Good any more big quests. Those quest lines, like Welcome guilds or anything. Welcome to the arena. You've come to watch the Grand Champion battle some of Cyrodiil's fiercest creatures. Who will survive? This week's epic battle of combatant versus beast. Let's find out. Lower the gates! Go! For victory! Okay. Oh. Okay. Ah. okay. Come on. Come on, die! Come on. Just keep blocking them off and then attacking them when they're... I suppose, when I have the chance to, I just guess. Come on. Come on, you're almost dead. I'll beat you. You're almost gone. One more. <coughs> Come on. Die. <coughs> Yay. Okay. Good people. The grand champion is victorious. This Damn it. Um, like, wow, just on it. Uh, just need to get rid of like something really small, but I can I can just repair my stuff, I guess. There we go. There we go. Leave the arena now and rest. You've earned it once again. Yeah, but it's summer holidays coming very shortly. I have nearly finished this whole uh, the whole week. And this week is my la was my last full week. I've only got like four school days left or something like that. Well or met. five. Five school days. Stop talking great Whoa. show. Great show. Ready. You really brought down the house. Here's your gold. Now get some rest and I'll see you next week. If I ever have a next week, I don't know if I'll ever come back to the arena, guys. It, this could have been my last one. My last show. We will see. 
Uh, yeah, so let's go and sell our stuff before we leave. Uh, Avalor has remembered something. Greetings. That he saw before he started the whole this whole thing. Which mentioned the champion of Cyrodiil. Um, okay, the market district, I think, is there. Yes, I'm pretty sure that is the market district. So, over the summer holidays, guys, I am really hoping to get a lot of LPs finished. I'm actually hoping to get, um, well, obviously Fallout 3, uh, Oblivion, and um, Metal Gear Solid 3 finished. No, I, I don't think Morrowind will be finished by the, end, by the summer holidays by the end of some holidays because I just don't think that they'll get enough It recorded. is good to see you again. Have I hoped to get a lot I done. offer the finest goods and lowest prices in if, all series. If that makes sense, you know, I hope to get a lot of it, you know, a lot of the LPs you drive um, a of that LP up so I don't have to worry about, you know, in the future when I I can just try and finish it by the end of 2013 or sometime in 2014. Okay. Just sell all this stuff. We're making quite a bit of money. Quite a lot of money is being made here. Do not worry. Don't need these potions of invisibility. That's a. F You've made a good bit of gold. That's a fair. A good price for a good customer. Um, reflect on potion of reflection, shock shield, sorcery. We potion a good of spell. You drive a hard, an excellent bargain. Let's see what else? Get rid of. I don't think there's anything else to get rid of. Not there. Hoping a hard lock. Don't need that. An excellent bargain. Yep, that's it. Thank you. Come again. Thank you. Come again. Yay. Please um, return soon. Okay. So. Ah. Uh, there we go. So that's what we need to do now. I think we've been to Macamante. How many more... Uh, Nenendavar. We haven't been to Nenendavar. Okay, I think we'll do Nenendavar first. Actually, no. We'll do this first. Yeah, we'll do this first. We'll go... We'll do this uh, Malada first. And then we will do Nenendavar. Now, I don't want to collect all the statues because for role-playing purposes as well, he wouldn't... I doubt he'll find them. And I don't actually know where they all are myself. Um, I know where, like, one of her is, which I don't want to go to, because they wouldn't randomly go into ruins. Avalor isn't doing that. Avalor isn't randomly going into ruins. But he's going to try and do this one, because he knows the location of, that is going to be in here. Well, it might be in there. Which it will be. But, you know, if you catch my drift from that. But yeah, he does want to go and do something first, because he does remember seeing something at the very start. I'm not going to say what it is yet. But he remembers something before he started this quest, epic quest, which is about a hundred parts ago, so I doubt you remember it. He he saw something and he was confused by it and he now it now makes sense to him. He wants to check it out. Okay. And we haven't even become a vampire in this LP. It's lasted like three hundred and twenty six parts and we haven't even uh, turned into a vampire. We haven't had to fight for the cure for that. And if I turn into a vampire now, I will be so pissed. I will be so pissed. Because then it means I'll have to spend another 100 parts trying <laughs> and turn myself or something. And, and I don't want to go and auto-save it because I have, because I'd have to carry on. So I'm, and I'm, I'm being serious guys. If I turn over into a vampire, and I hope I don't, I really will be pissed off. And I, will, and I do not want to do it. I do not want to turn myself into a vampire. Because then I have to go through the whole thing of completing that quest, which will take about 70 odd parts. So this LP will just... I don't even want to talk about that if that happens. Because I will be so pissed if that happens. 
Because that means as well that I'll have to put off Skyrim even longer, and, I, and I'm actually in the mode of planning Skyrim. I, I'm actually, I mean, I've been talking to uh, Liam, or, or Sushi Gamer Guy, only uh, the other day about, I've got an idea for my LP, and I was just saying, do you like the idea? Because I don't want to go to my subscribers and say, hey, yeah, this is what I'm doing. Because then you'll be like, oh, no surprises, or whatever like that. So I went, so I went to, Li to Liam, because he knows the Elder Scrolls more than uh, Luca, Nathan, or Darren. Not as much as me, of course.